I'm really excited because I'm going to share with you a concept that I got introduced to about a month and a half ago, and it's made a huge difference in my life. This is a skill that I'll be working on for at least the next year because the amount of gains that I get from it aren't going to plateau for a while because it's a difficult to master skill. It's insane how much this skill has impacted my life. Considering how much I do to improve my life and make it more efficient, this has been the biggest game changer for me in as long as I can remember. My name's Ray Benefield. Self-improvement is one of my special interests, and I'm excited to share this new concept. It's called mental agility. Real quick, I wanted to share a game that's got a special place in my heart. It's a great example of a toy mechanic. It's called Pinball Sumo. Your objective in Pinball Sumo is to ensure that you have the least deaths at the end of every round. Sabotage your friends and push them around to create chaos. Control that chaos to come out on top. Games like this and Risk and Reflection are the reason that I'm able to spend full time on this YouTube devlog series for months to come. Because of my ADHD, procrastination and forgetfulness are some of my biggest enemies right now in terms of getting things done. And I'm sure many of you can relate. The massive problem that I get from procrastination and forgetfulness is that I'll put something off, I'll forget that it needs to be done, and then I'll suffer some form of consequence in the future. Forgetting certain things can be a massive problem. And this was huge for me until I discovered mental agility. If you have to deal with procrastination or forgetfulness like I do, please drop a like and let's show some solidarity. I define mental agility as the ability to get something done sooner rather than later. The sooner you do it, the more agility you have. This essentially boils down to don't think about it, just do it before you put it off and forget about it. A couple examples are if I see trash on the ground or I see the bathroom counter needs to be wiped, I need to do it sooner rather than later and not put it off. If I put it off, I'll have a hard time coming back to it and then it'll, it'll just build up over days. The beauty of this skill is that you never had the chance to forget something because every time you have to get something done, you just do it. The biggest problem with putting off a task is that every day that you put it off, it builds anxiety and it makes it harder to go and complete that task. If you do this, you're gonna have this mental overhead and we want to get rid of that overhead so that way you can spend more time focusing on more important things like building a game. Not sure how many of you noticed, but I changed the color of the background. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I can almost guarantee that the biggest thing that people are gonna bring up is what if I can't do that particular task right now? Not all tasks are that simple. The thing about mental agility though, is that it's not just about getting the task done, it's about ensuring that a task gets done sooner rather than later. What this means is that if you run into a task that can't be completed right now, make a note of it and not a mental note, you'll forget that. Go write it on a post-it note, go write it in a notebook, pull up a to-do list app on your computer. This is something that I do often. I have like five to-do lists and for example if I come up with something that'll make my life more efficient like hanging up the spoons for some reason I write it down so I can manage it later and this skill doesn't just have to be used on responsibilities or adulting this can help your creativity as well you come up with an idea just go write it down real quick and this isn't enough you have to use discipline like we talked about in the last video keep revisiting your to-do list and your post-it notes make sure that you're getting tasks off of it because otherwise you're just procrastinating again if you don't address these tasks every single day you'll come up with the same problem and it will build anxiety in you and you'll forget it just like you would a mental note procrastination truly is the biggest enemy for most creators and i've just given you your best weapon as i mentioned i'm going to be working on this skill for like the next year it's a very difficult skill to master but the more i do it the better i get and the more gains that i get out of it and yes i hear you it's going to be difficult it'll probably be one of the hardest things i ask you to improve for yourself but that's okay because you can make it easier. For example, in my kitchen, I have everything hung up or put away. So this way, when I have to wipe the counter, I can just do it and there's nothing that I have to move. This is definitely a topic that I'm going to revisit in the future because I want time to practice it and learn from it. And then I'll talk about how much it's helped my success as well as tips and tricks so you can work on it more. We're going to put your mental agility to the test. Click on this previous video if you haven't seen it already. It's about a cure for motivation, which is huge. Speaking of cures, check out this next video where we talk about a cure for this whole I have no ideas problem because you do have ideas. If you don't see that link, it's probably because you're watching this on release day. Thank you. I'll see you tomorrow.